Hey fellow explorers, it's Chris from TDR Explorer and it's September and you know what that means? The start of Halloween. Well, it starts on September 8th, but the new today guides are out for both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea. So I'm gonna go through these with you and I'm gonna show you what's going on this month. All right, explorers, first we're gonna look at Tokyo Disneyland for September 1st until the 30th. And you can see we have Mickey in his Poppin' Alive outfit. He looks pretty stylish. <laughs> and as always, there's always a hidden Mickey and it's on the right side. So if you find it, let me know. On the inside, you're gonna find Mickey and friends and they're all dressed up for Halloween in their Poppin' Live concert, which is the Halloween parade that is happening at the park. And all the different characters represent different types of music. So it's the same parade as last year, but with updated costumes and music is the same idea. So here, just talking about all the characters. So we've got Stitch and we got Donald. And of course, my favorite Chip and Dale. And Max is also in there with Goofy, Mickey, Minnie, Clarice and Daisy. And then over here is just talking about all the different decorations that you'll find throughout the park. Uh, we have stuff happening um, in the entrance area and also in the hub area. You're going to find all these awesome decorations. And down over here, this is talking about the costume days. And this is for both Disneyland and Disney Sea. And for the first time this year, they're actually having costume days every day of the Halloween event from September 8th until 31st. And it's explaining that there are themes. And if you dress as the theme, you'll get something from the cast member. So from September 8th to 21st, it is a Disney princess. And then from September 22nd to October 5th is Pixar for in friends. And then we have October uh, 6th until 19th and it is Disney villains. And then from October 20th to 31st, Mickey and friends. And this is just uh, some of the rules. Um, if you want to change, you can't just change in any restroom. They have spe uh, specific ones. So just ask a cast member. And then over here, uh, we have the Haunted Mansion Holiday Nightmare, which started on September 2nd and goes all the way until July 3rd. So that's pretty awesome. Now we open up inside and there is a lot of stuff going on here. So I'm going to start at the bottom here and work my way around. So there's these little pendants that you can buy that are shaped like the Mickey balloons and it also talks and it glows and you get pink or blue and you can pick this up for 2300 yen and remember the trick if you want to know roughly how much something is in either Canadian Australian or US dollars just drop the last two digits and that's roughly how much it's gonna be so 2300 yen is about 23 dollars US it's gonna be a little bit more in Australian Australian and Canadian dollars it's gonna be around 25 26 dollars so up here we got some villains stuff we got quite a few actually um, we got some ears earmuffs ears no, no, no. it's weird where the money head and uh, then we got some hot pants or leggings I was gonna call them hot pants and then we have a pouch all these different pouches and then um, hair accessories and everything lot of stuff here especially if you're a fan of villains and then we've got some memos you can see on the left there how they look and then you can uh, fold them up to look like that that's pretty awesome and we've got some pens and stuff here too so this is at the Tokyo Disneyland and up here uh, we're getting into the specific Halloween stuff so there's a lot of the different sweets that you can get uh, I'm going to cover this in a full video, so make sure you go and watch that once it's up. Um, you can also go to this website, tdrgoods.jp slash sweets selection. It'll be all in Japanese, but you can see all the pictures and prices of all those things. So we got some candies and all this. It's pretty awesome stuff. Then up here, every season there is a charm that you can make, and this one is no different. So we have these different charms that you can create. And you pick a base, and then you pick the charms that go on it. 
and everything. Um, yeah, the, so it costs 2,600 yen to get it. So you can do this at the Monsters Inc. Company store. Now over here, it's all, well not all, this is just some of the Halloween stuff. So this um, is uh, generic Halloween stuff, lack of a better term, meaning it's available at both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea. So we got Huey, Dewey, Louie, and those are keychains, and they come as a set. Then we got Mickey over there dressed as a ghost. Then we got this Mickey ghost headband and my favorites, Chip and Dale. And again, they come as a set, 2800 yen. Um, you can get these black toothpaste. And then over here, uh, just like little candies. And then down here, this is the specific merchandise for Tokyo Disneyland. So as you can see, it's all music festival themed. So we have these towels here and you got one or the other, you get Mickey or Minnie. I did that backwards, but you know what I mean. And they're 1200 yen. And these are towels that you can like spin in the air or wear them around your neck. And then we got some wristbands, uh, different characters. So they have like Mickey, Minnie, Chip and Dale in there. And then we have a boom box cushion. Yes, a boom box cushion. It's crazy. Um, and then we have these t-shirts. One is called Pop and one is called Cool. It's basically black or white. Um, it has the different characters on it. And these are all the prices and sizes. So on the left there, you can see those are the uh, prices and sizes. The ones that are in centimeters, those are children's. And then the um, adult is small, medium, large, extra large, and extra, extra large. That's what the 3L means. And here, this is just talking about a bandana and uh, other accessories that you can buy. Again, I'm gonna have a full video on this, so you can check that out once it's on the channel. All right, over here, we got food, 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 food. Uh, we have this wrap. Um, we have this cone that you can get the gazebo. It has pumpkin and mashed potato in it. Yes, pumpkin and mashed potato. <laughs> and over here, this is a pizza. We can get a Captain Hook's galley, which is pumpkin or chicken, pumpkin, pizza. And then up here, we have the special set. Oh my goodness, this looks good. And this at the plaza. As a pavilion restaurant and you can also get there's a souvenir lunch case that you can get with the pizza I forgot to mention that at the Huey Dewey Louie Good Time Cafe you can get this scallop sandwich as in the shape of a pumpkin this Jack Skeleton curry bread and also a um, pumpkin cinnamon roll this at the Sweetheart Cafe it looks super good and then down here we have some sweets um, the little souvenir cup up there is at the Sweetheart Cafe. Um, and it comes with a chocolate mousse in it. Both orange and white chocolate mousse. And then we have a candy case down here. Because of little candies inside. And then we have this cranberry cheesecake with souvenir plate. And then again, it's at the Sweetheart Cafe. And over here we got more Halloween stuff. And we got the, all these different sundaes. Uh, the one on the left has a Mickey churro and mixed berry cream. And then on the right uh, we have matcha jelly with van uh, vanilla ice cream. And they come with this op like right in the middle there. You can see uh, it comes with a optional souvenir cup if you like. So that's kind of cool. You just add 360 into the 500 yen price. Down here, we got some Tipo Tortas. These are quite nice. Uh, one is cheese, cream, and blueberry. And the other one is sweet potato. And then down here, we have a churro, which is maple pumpkin churro. And then down here, we have pumpkin soft serve ice cream. Yeah, you read that right. Also, we do have a list of all these on our website too, explaining where they all are. So don't worry if you missed anything, it'll be on our website. I'll have the link in the description. And then we have the tapioca drink, which is mixed berry. And you can see Minnie there. 
and you can get a souvenir coaster you can see on the left all right enough of the Halloween stuff we've got brand new stuff that's not even Halloween themed so we got uh, this Cinderella popcorn bucket which I am told they actually had it in the US parks so it's kind of odd that we have it now here and then over here we have this Mickey shaped gloved pork sandwich looks really Good, and that's at Boiler Room Bites. Uh, down here, this is just regular um, regular food that's always available. They're just highlighting it. Same thing with over here. Uh, just stuff at um, Plasma Rays and Tomorrowland Terrace and the refreshments corner. Um, over here, we have all these different character shirts. So there's children sizes and there's adult sizes. Uh, again, where there's the numbers there are the centimeters, that's the kid sizes. And then down here, these are the adult sizes. And this one is actually pretty awesome. I'm gonna have to try the large and see if that fits me because I definitely want this. It's kind of hard to see, but you can see like there's all these different characters. Country Bears, Mickey, all that. It's very busy. <laughs> Uh, and down here we got more character stuff. We have there's a tote bag and pouch and a hat with a palm on it and keychains and socks and a backpack and a pouch and everything. There's a ton of stuff to buy you guys. There's so much. All right, we're going to take a look at Disney Sea now. Next we have Tokyo Disney Sea and on the cover it features Minnie Mouse in the Villains World show. And as always, there is a hidden Mickey and it's on the right side. Again, if you find it, let me know in the comments. Open it up and you're gonna find information on the Villains World Harbor Show at Tokyo Disney Sea. This is the third time that the show is running. They're gonna add new elements to it and the costumes are pretty much the same as the years before, but it's a fun show, especially if you haven't seen it, you're gonna love it. Um, and down here, uh, this is explaining the costume days, which it's the exact same thing as Tokyo Disneyland, so I won't go over that again, but same dates for all the different um, themes that they're doing and everything. And there's special spots to change, so just make sure you ask a cast member if you need to change, because you can't do it at any, just any washroom. Up here, this is just talking about the live entertainment. Uh, there's going to be cast members that are dressed up and they're going to be checking your fashion and they're going to critique you on that and that's the Ameri in the American waterfront. And then at the Casbah food court there is some live entertainment there as well. So make sure you go and check that out. And down here this is talking about Duffy and Friends, uh, the uh, decorations that are going to be happening. So. In the Mediterranean Harbor, you can see on the left side, there's gonna be a little painting from Gelatoni. They always change it for the season now. And then of course, Stella Lou's little photo area, photo op area, where you can take a picture with your Stella Lou on a little stage. And this is the American waterfront and it overlooks the SS Columbia. And then up here, uh, it's just talking about the Step to Shine show that's happening in the American waterfront in front of the SS Columbia. So uh, when you grab an English park map, make sure you check the times. And then this is just talking about the new Nemo and Friends attraction and also uh, the updated version of Turtle Talk. Open it up and you're gonna find a whole lot of information. So I'm gonna start at the top here and work my way around. So up here, uh, this is talking about the Halloween rod, the same thing that they have at Tokyo Disneyland, which is up here. Uh, the only thing that's different is these charms. These are unique to Disney Sea, so Disneyland also has unique charms, and you can get this in the Lost River Delta. Uh, down here, this is just talking about the candy, which I already explained in the Tokyo Disneyland one. Uh, down here, again, this is more uh, stuff that you can get also at Disney Sea, the villains, uh, hair accessories and stuff. Uh, down here, you can only get this at Disney Sea and Bon Voyage, which is just outside my Hama station. And this is the 16th anniversary merchandise. There's much more than what they're showing here. We do have it on our website, but this is for the 16th anniversary of Tokyo Disney Sea. And you can see it's port discovery theme. So we got some um, stuffed keychains with all the different characters and they're dressed as scientists. And we have my favorites, Chip and Dale. And there's a postcard up there and there's a button and everything 
there's a whole bunch of merchandise for this. So make sure you check. There's even beakers that are meant to be drink, drank out of. That's so awesome. Um, this is the same as Tokyo Disneyland, you know, all the character shirts and merchandise, so I'll just skip over that. Down here, this is Duffy and Friends. You can only get this at Disney Sea. There's no other place you can get it. So, Duffy and Friends, you can see their co these are the costumes that they have this year that you can buy for your Duffy and Friends. They're 4,800 yen a piece. Then over here, we have Gelatoni, Stella Lou, Duffy and Shelly Mae dressed in Halloween outfits and they're 1,700 yen. And we got some um, cookies on the left there, comes with a little bag. And then we have updated merchandise as well. So we got um, some rusk with the little box. And then we got some socks with all four characters. And we got mini towels. And then we have ears. And then we have the full set. We have Duffy, Shelly May, Gelatoni, and Stella Lou. The Gelatoni and Stella Lou go on sale September 4th. And that goes with the rest of the Halloween Duffy merchandise. Um, over here, this is just talking about um, updated Duffy and Friends food. Uh, you can get this at the Cape Cod Confection. And this is just a, um, a, a roll with a souvenir case and everything. And over here, this is uh, this has been uh, available for a while. So there's like a, a burger, you can get a little lunch case, and there's also a souvenir plate and a souvenir cup and everything. Up here, we have the Nemo and Friends stuff. So we have the bucket, popcorn bucket still available, and we also have all the different sweets and stuff, which I've covered in a previous video. And this is just normal menu items. Up here, we have Halloween food, oh my goodness. We have all this information on our website in English, so I won't I won't go through all of it in great detail. But uh, we have the special set at the Yucatan Base Camp Grill, and there's like a sausage and everything, and it comes. There's also a special cocktail that you can get. So good. And then up here, uh, this is at uh, Zambini Brothers. And then up here, uh, we have a scallop cream deep fried sandwich and it's purple that looks really good and this is at Sebastian's Calypso Kitchen in uh, Mermaid Lagoon and then up here uh, this is a ham and purple cabbage sandwich it's at the New York Deli and then we have this special curry set black curry and this is at the Casbah Food Court uh, down here there's more snacks there's this um, a Cassis beer cocktail that's at Barnacle Bills in American Waterfront. And then we have this sparkling drink uh, with black tapioca and it's sour white and citrus. And it's at the Hudson River Harvest. And they changed up the Gyoza Dog this year. Last year it was Cruella DeVille themed. This year it is the Queen of Hearts themed. And from what I can tell, it's just the normal flavor, it's just colored differently. Um, making a return this year is the spicy shrimp and pork steamed bun. You can get this at Seaside Snacks, which is in Port Discovery. It's pretty awesome. And up here, these are the same ones you can get at Tokyo Disneyland as well. We got on the left, we have the maple and pumpkin churro. Then we have the black tipple torta, which is cheese, cream, and blueberry. And then we also have the sweet potato on the right. And then over here, even more stuff, there's so much. So down here we got this little um, dessert and it comes with a souvenir cup. So good. Uh, it's, mix, it's a mixed berry dessert. And up here, uh, the souvenir plate and it's a chocolate tart. And then get that Mama Biscottis. And over here, um, you get the sparkling mixed berry drink. And it has black tapioca in it. And it also you can get this Ursula souvenir coaster. That's pretty cool. And that's at Sebastian's Clipso Kitchen. And then over here we have this sweet potato and pumpkin cup dessert. 
It also comes with a souvenir cup you can see there. So that's pretty cool. And then we have merchandise. Um, as I mentioned, the Disneyland video, there is merchandise that they have at both parks. This is one of them, the Huey Dewey Louie, Chip and Dale. There's also um, this brownie, <laughs> which is um, uh, just one of the souvenirs that you can get. And then a mug, and there is ears, Mickey ears. That's pretty awesome. Then we got some headbands here, and we have a uh, special t-shirt. Again, they have uh, children's sizes, and they also have up to 3L for adults. And also she's wearing um, these ears that you can buy as well. And that is all for Tokyo Disney Sea. It's quite a bit. All right, explorers, thank you so much for joining me as I went through the Today Guide for both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea. And remember, you can pick these up right at the turnstiles when you go into either park. So if you want to learn more, you can visit our website, tbrexplorer.com. Don't forget to subscribe to us here on YouTube. And if you enjoy what we do, head over to our Patreon because we have some exclusive content on there. All right, explorers, I'm going to go check some of this stuff out. Until next time.